My name is uh, Professor Akinsanya Cambon, and um, this uh, painting is called Detroit Blue in Vietnam. You know, um, I think that the reason this painting is important is because this was an event that happened at a, a very crucial time in the Vietnam War. And I think a lot of people don't really understand what was taking place in Vietnam in 65, 66, and 67. And I think that was a really, really big turning point in the war. I'm not saying that we would have won had it not happened. <coughs> but um, this was, uh, when I got to Vietnam, I was like 19 years old, 18, 19. When I, when I went to the Marine Corps, I was 19. I was about 20 when I got to Vietnam. And um, this, um, this event happened in 67. And it's something that really bothered me. And one of the reasons it bothered me was because there was a brother we called Blue. And he was really, really dark-skinned brother, and he's out of Detroit. Now, we had about three different blues, but this one was Detroit Blue. And you had to say the blue, what city he was from, because we had a Chicago Blue, we had a St. Louis Blue, and we had a Detroit Blue. And, you know, so, but he, was 26 I believe he was older than the rest of us and he could read and it's difficult to say that that many of us even in the Marine Corps you had a lot of the African soldiers in the Marine Corps that were illiterate or semi-illiterate we could barely read and I was one of the ones that could barely read I mean I could read but I think I read it like a third second or third grade level so um, Blue used to gather about 15 of us around every week when the Stars and Stripes came out. And he would read us the different things that we felt was significant in the Stars and Stripes to let us know what was going on back in the States and let us know things that were going on that affected our lives as, uh, as military men in Vietnam. So one week, <coughs> he came forth with the newspaper and he was reading to us in the Stars and Stripes where the Geneva Convention had convened and they had banned the use of the 50 caliber machine gun and the 12 gauge shotgun in Vietnam. He said that we can no longer use the 50 caliber machine gun and the 12 gauge shotgun, that it was overkill to use those weapons and it was against the law, against the rules of Geneva. These are the rules that I guess you fight a war by. And that's ridiculous how you're gonna have rules to fight a war where you're killing people. <laughs> 